guys, it's Queen BJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting during two episodes five and six of Monthly Girls Nozaki Kun. Let's go ahead and get started with episode five and three, two, one, go. Because <sighs> Yeah, that's why. Because <laughs> they showed it at the end of four. Mind you, it's been almost like a week since I've watched both episodes one through four because I watched them at the same time. Yeah. What if your mom came over, or your dad, or your grandma? No talking with the hell. But it's a, it's a man. It's not a woman. <laughs> Chill. It's okay. <laughs> I can't. See, now I kind of want the full song of this and the cover too from Bendity. But the one thing that I hate about Bendity covers is that, especially because if you have an Apple Music account like I do, it is hard to literally find the covers of these songs. Like, the full cover. <laughs> I mean, I don't always want to go on YouTube and download it through YouTube and such, but sometimes you have to. It's hot. <laughs> nice to meet you, Ken. Well, look, at least it wasn't a woman. Come here, Cody. Well, that was great. Yeah, but I would... He's interesting. Come here, Cody. <laughs> yeah. I mean, do you even have a relationship with your editor besides just being, you know, the editor and, you know, Arthur relationship? You, you know, job? Have you ever gone out with him? Not like that, but like us friends. Hell, I was even about to say, go out for a drink, but you're a minor. <laughs> You can't drink. Why? <laughs> um. mm. 
Well, I mean, he's cute. So what happened? Yeah? Valentine's Day one shot. Of course, you would say that. Cut ties with him. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> okay. The rat, the tinnuki. Oh my god. It's going to be there. Because, oh god, the Tanuki died. It's Danganronpa, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> you just need Monokuma to pop out and be like, a body has been discovered. Just friends. Black ink. You mean like just for drawing? You sorry? Oh. I mean, seriously, why do you want to kick it to Nuki?
I mean, like, don't get me wrong. That Tanuki is, like, so adorable, and I kind of want one. Just, like, a plushie. They could have stuff on Amazon right now. I want it so bad. Why would you want to eat? Okay. Yeah. Are we going to see the Tanuki? All over, yeah, because there's the Tanuki. Uh huh. It, oh my god. <laughs> no. Not really. No, stop touching that. <laughs> when did you go to the movie park? Oh, you're so cute. What? Are you serious? <laughs> we won't talk more about that at the end of the episode because, um... <laughs> Look at Gio! Gio was like, I do not want to listen to this dude and his shit. <laughs> He's like, hmm. You know what, Nozaki? I really agree with you on that. I mean, he is a pretty boy. A cute, pretty boy. But, I mean... Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. My god, there's a new Is she doing anything else besides calling him? Okay, if you say so.
You know, you could just ask Chio for advice. Nozaki, I love you so much. I really do. God, what is this? Well, it's a good thing he made enough for everybody. Is Miko Dink gonna show up in this episode? Because, I mean, I'm trying to see my cute Blake <laughs> in the president soon. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> There's a whole thing Don't worry, they're close. What the Your special someone is Chio. Chio. <laughs> because you did. I'm sorry.
on seal. <laughs> Good. Now put it into no words, pictures. Nozaki's previous editor. You know, he kind of reminds me, it's one of the episodes in Little Witch Academia when I, but way, 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 like probably one of the first shows that I really reacted to. Not really, it was kind of like my 10th or 20th or Thursday, 30th show I did. Um, but there was one episode where it was the bee, and if the bee, like, uh, stabbed you, you fell in love with somebody, whether it could be yourself or, like, <laughs> his previous editor it's someone who is just in love with himself in a way i mean there are some people who are like that in real life but then it makes you wonder like oh my god you you just i don't know what how to feel about you but he <laughs> i can understand why nozaki has an editor like ken now <laughs> every time when nozaki was trying to say something and the previous editor comes in and he's like, why don't you do that? That's a good idea. I'm glad I came up with that idea. I'm like, you know what, you little shit? Like, no. I came up with idea with that idea way before I called you on the phone and said, I want to do this. <laughs> but it was cute that, you know, Nozaki got to be one of his characters for a half of an episode. <laughs> I mean, that was so adorable. Oh my god. I think he's the last guy who's supposed to be in the room now. <laughs> Her derpy face. <laughs> but honestly, yes. Seeing him, Nozaki, hand out lunches that he's made to his friends. Oh my god, it's me, Cody, my baby. So precious. I love him so much. Like, oh my god. It, it just felt so weird. The fact is that we were getting closer and closer to the end of this episode, and I was like, oh my god, like, Mikorin or the president have not made an appearance in this episode. I was like, oh my god, th this is like some sadness just washed over me. <laughs> because the president, like, the first four, and I was like, this is about to be the first episode where they are not gonna be mentioned or, like, have a freaking role. And then, nope. You did it. <laughs> it's like how would you want. Whether the old fruit basket or the new fruit basket, and you're like sitting here and you're waiting for a certain character to like show up, and they finally show up, and you're just like so excited. <laughs> like, me, when you're getting Asaharu, or Hattori, <laughs> or my baby Kisa, like any of those characters when they showed up, and I was like on the floor, either like excited or. Or I cried because I was like, oh my god, like, they're finally here. And I can finally talk about why I love these characters so much. And I mean, it's like that with other characters in season two of Fruits Basket. Because I can't really talk about them yet. Because they're not here yet. But, like, my horse girl, she is coming. And I cannot wait because she is gorgeous. And I love her so much. And just, mm, that feeling that you just have for seeing your favorite characters. I mean, uh, but this was... This is a really good episode. Like, I, can we just talk about that? His previous editor with the amusement park pictures. I'm thinking, okay, these are gonna be really nice pictures of the amusement park. <laughs> no, 
<laughs> because he's so in love with himself. He's like, mm mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Here's a picture of me and another picture of me and another picture of me. You're like, I don't want pictures of you. <laughs> you are cute. He is the cutest, like, pretty boy besides Mikorin because Mikorin is so, oh my god, because that's Bakugo's VA and everybody knows how much I'm in love with Bakugo's VA. Um, he is so gorgeous, but, like, our pretty boy is just pretty. That's it. He don't have nothing else to him. Unless, like, there was another episode on him and focusing on him a lot more. He's pretty. He's arrogant, you know, because... <laughs> It was my idea first, but still, that's all he has to me. But yeah, go ahead and pause the video, and I'll see you guys in one second for episode six. Okay, episode six in three, two, one, go. Oh. <laughs> you know that still shocks me about Z Yuzu. Oh my God. <laughs> I love her so much. I love all these characters. Remember, Yuzu, there's no I in team. Jesus, girl. Oh. Oh. I is so cute. <gasps> Are you okay? Hmm. He seems like the type of character who always gets hurt. He cute though. But why he getting hurt? Like, oh my god. <laughs> I can't. Poor baby. Like, oh my god. Hmm. <laughs> I need his VA to be in like one of those dating sim games. I automatically pick him. Like, oh my god, no. See, if there was a dating sim game that had Bakugo's VA, freaking Mamari, <laughs> my Riku from Kingdom Hearts, <laughs> and any other male voice actor I've fallen for, that'd be hard. <laughs> Like, honestly, let's think about that. Like, if you have your top five favorite female VAs and your top five favorite males, and there was a game specifically for them, <laughs> I'd just be like, can I just go the harm route, please? Because I can't choose just one. I mean, this is like how with Idol Masher or any other gotcha game that I play and you have a best girl or a best boy, it, it's hard. To choose just one. I've done it for Cinderella Girls, and then I have my like top twenty or five. Is it? <laughs> yeah. It's complicated.
I mean, yeah, just look at Yuzu. I mean, she is terrifying. Yeah. But there are some girls when they play basketball, like, they go hard. I should know because I knew some of them girls. <laughs> when I played basketball in middle school and elementary school. Uh-oh, welcome on to- Seriously? You're falling asleep? Oh, but he looks so cute. Are you sleeping yet? Well, wait until you find out who that voice is. <laughs> the long dude. Don't tell him. Don't tell him. Don't tell him. Do not tell him. <laughs> no, Zaki. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> when Waka finds out. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. You always gotta love the characters who always argue so much. I mean, it's like that with my best characters, and love is hard for Otaku because they argue way too much and they're so poor each other. Uh. <laughs> Well, Waka, I'm glad. <laughs> Which is good, but when he finds out <laughs> who that lovely voice belongs to. Waka, just stand your ground. Stand your ground. Uh-huh. Oh, my Please tell me you're not going to challenge her to a duel of basketball. Please. No, no. Waka. Waka. Don't do it. I have a bad feeling about this. Hey, user. Yeah, but you basically straight up wrote it as a love letter! Huh. I have a bad feeling still. So I'm scared.
No. I already call him Waka too, but he's <laughs> Yeah, you do. Do you have like a crush on Waka or something? I think so too. She just has like a hard way of showing it to him. Yeah, because girls hate that. Please don't. It's one of the most like. Ugh. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Jesus, here we go. Oh, God. Ah. But she is more alive. Oh, I know that I can meet you. <laughs> Waka, I love you so much. Oh. Seriously? Seriously? Well, Waka, you know, A for effort, babe. Yeah. Yeah, he did. Hey, forever, baby. Hey, forever. Well, at least he didn't find out. <laughs> I knew that was coming. But there's got to be a point where Waka is going to find out the truth about, it. <laughs> about that song. I mean, come on. <clears throat> Pernozaki? Mm 
Well, you can always go back to the store. Oh, wow. You, oh my. Nozaki? Are you serious? That's what you want to help with? Your deadline? You want them to... <laughs> How? No. You sleep and let them just... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. No. Please sleep. You know, hold up, wait, 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 wait. Let me go ahead and say this. Why didn't they call my husbando, Mikorin, Nozaki? You could have had Mikorin help these people. <laughs> I mean, Sakura's been helping you. Let's go, Sakura, since helping you since episode one. Mikorin's been helping you for a while. I'm gonna try not to laugh, but oh my god. A user. You two think so much alike. Mm -hmm. So like roses? <laughs> yes, we would think of her. <laughs> y 
like you can't always use that one. I mean, yes, yeah, he's a pretty boy, but like. Even in his sleep, and the fact that he was sick, he still worries about his son's sleep. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, my stomach hurts. <laughs> Hold up, wait. Wait. Hold up. Hold up, bruh. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Time out. Time out. Time out. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> this is the funny. You're telling me that when someone is depressed, you have kira kira. <laughs> that sparkle. They did good. A for effort. <laughs> that was this episode in a nutshell. A for effort. They need to try again. I'm glad Nozaki's extending his <laughs> so that he can go back and change the things that they messed up on. Because, oh my god. You don't put, like. <laughs> Secret. <laughs> sure. That's his black market for ya. <laughs> uh, just so precious like I really thought episode like when he came at the end of episode one going on episode two I really thought I wasn't gonna like him but oh my god this boy this man I can't and it's worse than his Bakugos voice actor because I love him so much like oh my god like seriously I can't with him but like honestly <laughs> I hope that the next time when Nozaki needs help and he asks Waka, you know, and the freaking, and freaking Chiyo, 
that, you know, he shows them, this is what you need to do for the background. Give me some Kita Kita. Not depressing on, like, you know, Kita Kita cute stuff. Like, no. No, 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 no. Unless you want to go, like, the cute horror route, which, I mean, hey, that's good. You could do that. Make it, like, somewhat cute, but then horror at the same time, which could be good. You never really know. As someone who likes cute things in horror and how when they mix together, it's, like, the most gorgeous thing ever, really, honestly. I mean, I've seen it so many times in, like, animes and then TV shows and the mangas, and it's just so freaking good. But, yeah, I mean, next time, really, Nozaki needs to just, when he's not sick, because, oh my god, I mean, this dude has worked himself to the bone, so of course, I figured there was going to be an episode that he, where he was going to be sick, but a day when he isn't sick, and he is 100% healthy, and they're there, just show them the differences between depressed background and kita kita, <laughs> which is cute, because honestly, you really don't put sparkles for depressing and then depressing for cuteness i mean <laughs> i mean honestly looking at it it's just <laughs> it's so adorable i don't know what's wrong poor baby though i mean imagine if he said that to ken ken would have been like nozaki what the fuck is this <laughs> But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episodes 5 and 6 of Monthly Girls Nozaki Kun. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episodes 7 and 8. Bye, guys.